Welcome to the Central Florida Gardening Show. Tiva, what are you doing? Well, I'm collecting rain pollen. It's been pouring in there and all the buckets got filled up. And I filled up all those. And now there's some in the so we sent it one to the bucket, so I'm just filling this stuff up. Oh, you filled it up with the rainwater mm -hmm. from the spigot? Yep. And now, all this, we couldn't carry all of it. And it dropped down here. So we did a little piece of went to that one. So I'm just going to fill up the all these little buckets with the rainwater. But it's not going to waste and then we can use all this water. Not let the grass suck it all. That's right. And all our plants over there. It's pretty efficient of you. Uh huh. But I'm just gonna take all this rainwater and put it into those these buckets that need to be filled up. Some of them is kind of gross, but still not to waste. And here's our mop's tea over there, and um. You put all this stuff in it, make it more sticky, but I don't want to talk about it all. Yeah, we got some, we got some mulch tea right here. We put some bat guano into it. That's why it's kind of brown and some, some glacial rock, powdered glacial rock, good minerals. This has magnesium, cobalt, iron, and sodium and calcium. Good stuff to put into the food that you eat. Make it more nutritious. And if you go over there somewhere, you can still go find more buckets of water fill. If, you, if it all, when it gets all gone and the grass gets it all off and we use it, well, we can still go get more over there. We'll probably, it's lots, we have lots of buckets and they'll probably be filled up over there somewhere. Well, this is a great method to get water. Thanks for sharing with us, Tiva. Mm -hmm.